you actually were traveling in November, correct? Where did you travel? Uh, to the Caribbean. I went to the Grenadines, and I go every year for my birthday. Right. And you traveled like 30 hours to get home, and when you got back, uh, you felt sick, and you, you thought you had pneumonia, but after about two weeks, you did go to the doctor, and you found out you did have pneumonia, correct? Well, yes, we thought that's what it was. I mean, my this was happening way before anybody knew about COVID. And I, I was, I've had pneumonia many times. So that's what I thought it was. Um, and I was coughing so much that I couldn't sleep at night. I was maybe one or two hours of sleep. When was it that you finally got diagnosed and they found this, uh, that you were positive for COVID-19? Well, it was a complete shock the way that this happened. Originally, you know, I thought it was pneumonia and we're done with it and I didn't think anything of it. And then a friend of mine who works with the university who is who's working on this clinical trial to understand the effects of antibodies said, I remember you were sick in December. Just in case, let's test your blood and see if you have antibodies. I got tested along with other uh, another couple of friends and they tested with nothing and I came back with the antibodies. So I was absolutely shocked. So that's how you became part of this UCLA study, right? Yeah, that's right. And it wasn't until the end of March that I found that I had the antibodies, even though I was sick in December. You're going to donate plasma that, that will then be spun up and used in treatment of people that have a severe case of, of the disease, right? Yes, uh, from what I understand, they can actually divide out my plasma across many uh, uses. One of them will be to treat very critical COVID-19 patients. They say that my antibodies can either stop the um, COVID in its tracks or actually even help them heal further. Um, and then some of my plasma, they said they're going to they're gonna freeze it. It can last up to a year, and they're going to use that to do more studies on how we can beat this thing. Oh, wow. So they can freeze it. That's great. I assume that because of the power of this, that you really encourage others who feel they've had COVID-19 to get tested for antibodies, and if they have them, to donate the way you're doing. Yes, absolutely. I mean, I think many of us feel helpless you know we're doing all we can we're washing our hands we're covering our our nose and mouth but there you know you, you do feel helpless and so if you find out you have COVID-19 antibodies in your plasma I absolutely highly encourage anyone to do it you could save multiple lives that way no question about it and this is an FDA approved study at UCLA there's 850 people in it at this point and so this is a very organized and important step towards getting this under control.